Hi friends, this is Miss Horn. I'm so excited to see you at kindergarten tomorrow. I have a book I would like to read with you. This is called The Night Before Kindergarten. Can you see? Look what's happening on the cover. It looks like the little girl's ready for kindergarten. She's excited. And tonight is your very last night before kindergarten. So I wanted to read this to you and enjoy this book with you um, and let you know that I'm really, really excited to see you tomorrow on Thursday for your very first day of kindergarten. Here's the title, The Night Before Kindergarten. And the author is Julie Durrell. She's the one who wrote the book. Here's the title page. Twas the night before kindergarten, and as they prepared, Kids were excited and a little bit scared. They tossed and they turned about in their beds while visions of school supplies danced in their heads. Erasers and crayons and pencils galore were stuffed in their backpacks and set by the door. Outfits were hung in the closets with care, knowing that kindergarten soon would be there. In the morning it came, school starts today. Would the teacher be nice? Would they still get to play? Faces were washed and teeth were brushed white. Kids posed for pictures with eyes sparkling bright. Parents packed snacks and kids hopped in cars as if they were boarding a spaceship to Mars. Some kids brought blankets or their favorite stuffed bear in hopes they could nap like they did in daycare. Their parents exclaimed, you're big kids, wow. Let us hold your bears and blankies for now. The parents were worried their children would cry if they left them at school with just a goodbye. So they told their darlings, if you want, we can stay and make sure that everything will be a-okay. The teacher then greeted each one with a smile and invited the students to stay for a while. The room was all filled with toys, books, and maps, but where were the bed for where were the beds for mid-morning naps? We don't take naps in kindergarten. We have lots of fun though. They colored and painted and played, Simon says, and stood on their head, oh, then tumbled and skipped and stood on their heads. They sang silly songs from beginning to end. Within just a minute, each kid had a friend. They're having lots of fun in kindergarten, just like we're gonna have. The children were happy. They loved Miss Sunrise. It was she who was in for a giant surprise. When what to her wondering eyes should appear, but sad moms and dads who were holding back tears, their noses so sniffly, their eyes red and wet. This was the saddest goodbye Miss Sunrise had seen yet. She gathered the grown-ups on the magical rug, then sent them away after one final hug. The children all waved from the door of the school. Don't cry, Mom and Dad. Kindergarten is cool. I am so excited to see you tomorrow for kindergarten. Don't forget to put your jitter glitter underneath your pillow, and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye, friends.